this is a this is a legend. Um, four months, fifteen thousand miles. Oh, okay. Right there. On the road trip. And then it's now like a conference room. <laughs> So usually when we have like past road trippers come through or watch your step, they <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we allow them to stay in and they can feel free to crash. Oh, that's yeah. amazing! Yeah. I should have hit you guys up on Friday night. Yeah. <laughs> well, if yeah. you make it back down, you can give them a call. Yeah. <laughs> so this is all. Um, oh my gosh. Original signatures from the original road trip. Um, and this like we use this as a little. That's the area. table. You get you start yeah. you know brainstorming. Brainstorming. <laughs> so yeah, if you ever watch the original, everything that goes on is right in here. Is right in here. And so wow. We've kind of turned it into like a little. What is it like living out of an RV for that long? Honestly, I <laughs> I really enjoyed it. Like it, really. It's a little intense just being with people like the same people. Right. But you like love them. Like at the end, you guys are really close and right. you're really bonding and like. But there's just times where it's like, whoa, this is. But it's. That's what's cool about it is because you don't usually ever go through anything like that intense uh -huh. and that in like in, in close quarters. Cool. But like, I loved it. Like wow. being able to travel and like have a having like a home, like in a city like that you can go back to. But then you guys can go somewhere else in the city using that and like that's cool. People spot it and people are always like, yeah, the RV and <laughs> right, and, like, right. The open road. It, being no. on the open road is like amazing. What's it's what's crazy. the most amount of people that are going going on the trips and living in this kind of a space? Um, well, probably the roadie tour, which is four, but then sometimes people from the office will fly out and meet them on the road, and so, the most we've ever had, I, once was six, so. Oh, yeah. That would be Just nice. for one night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And so. Totally gonna say a motorcycle tour is coming next. Who's, uh, who's your favorite signature on here I want to try to get? Ooh, let's see, there's, they have a bunch of these. Ooh, yeah. Ben Younger is actually really cool. Who is the he's a, he wrote um, writer and director of the Boiler Room. Oh, oh right. nice. Yeah, and he was he was talking about yeah how he ate. Was oh, this is uh, Michael Dell. Yes. Right. He was he was super cool too. They said he was an amazing guy. Charlie Trotter Charlie is that guy. is that Charlie Trotter? Yep. Yeah, he he owns one of the most, most famous restaurants in Chicago. Oh, where really? I'm from. Yeah, so. Yeah. And I remember reading in the book something uh, like uh, one of the uh, fishermen uh, out of Massachusetts or, or Maine, Maine or Maine, Maine lobster, lobster man. man. Yeah. yeah, Manny the lobster man. And the guy who founded Nantucket Nectars, I think. Yes, them too. Let's head back here a little bit. They did um, <laughs> one of the directors, one of the producers of Saturday Night Live. <laughs> Are there any lights in here? Actually, yeah, <laughs> that's the only thing. Yeah, we go, we go a little bit dark here. I think they're working. It's okay. I think that the RV's drinking more than enough. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. It's funny because people always talk about, hey, you guys should go on a re uh, reunion senior citizen tour. <laughs> They're definitely like, our time's passed. Yes, we're going to stay put for yeah. a while. And we're going to let that go and let others have their experience. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, so. Steph, so be careful, <laughs> This is actually our meeting room, our big giant meeting room for our staff meetings. So it's a really cool meeting room. We all just plop down on the couches. The other two RVs are out right now. Mm -hmm. That's pretty much what we have. We just actually built this like in the past week. We built the shed. Nice. And then this deck was built, but then we put up all the beams. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. Cover for the roadies to hang out and spend some time. Chilling. Happy Chilling. hour room. Yeah, happy hour spot. <laughs> and then the fleet, which is not I just took out on the road um, this past, yeah, I think it might be long. It's all good. Yeah, we, we, we just took this guy out. We went from here uh, out to Texas, up to Wisconsin, and Minnesota, and then back across Washington. And What's the average length of a road trip? Um, if you're going like a summer one for PBS, it's about six weeks. Six oh, weeks now I'm thinking mileage, maybe? Oh, like, mileage? Yeah. I'm not, it actually depends on... on Route. The first guy, theirs was four months, fifteen thousand miles. Great. Yeah, that's that's a lot. That'd be our manifesto. Yeah. I like the blah blah blah. Yeah. <laughs> what do you do now? I'm actually employed. Yeah. I uh, fought the good fight for yeah. a commercial real estate brokerage firm. Yeah. And uh, lost. 
Yes. <laughs> so I'm uh, I'm on the search for something. Definitely. I do a lot of writing. Um, mm. I love communications. I've gotten really, really, really uh, involved with social media, and I'm like a Twitter nerd to like the awesome. degree. Yeah. So hoping I can find something either in PR or internal communications. Or something like that. You should follow Richard Nation on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> I actually was watching you guys that. a little bit. And all of us. Really yeah, but that's pre that is pretty much like it. We are not as big as an operation as we, we seem on the outside. You guys are overachievers? <laughs> yeah, we definitely are. We do a lot like with, a, with a small staff, but we have a really dedicated, like, super strong staff. Well, this is such a cool cause. I think the people who get involved have to have a really big passion for it. Yeah, so. oh, the, the founders are amazing. Oh, yeah. Definitely. They understand this whole thing that we do here is, like, right. bigger than they are. Yeah. And so, and they never put themselves as a